friends we have learned about pictographs and bar graphs now we shall learn the collection of data and its representation in the form of pictographs and bar graphs let us understand the terms data collection and recording of data information in the form of numerical figures is called data for example there are 35 students in class 5 is numerical information and is therefore a data anju is beautiful is not numerical information so it is not data there are different ways of collection and recording of information or data let us observe a few examples of collection of data suppose the organizer of a cricket match wants to know the ages of the players of both the teams including one extra player in each team he noted their ages in years the age of 24 players are 19 21 30 27 22 21 27 21 22 19 27 27 21 21 23 22 21 27 30 25 23 21 22 23 but recording information in this way does not help him to answer the questions like a what is the maximum age of a player b how many players are 22 years of age c how many players are 25 years of age d what is the difference between maximum and minimum age now he writes the above information in ascending order 19 19 21 21 21 21 21 21 21 21 22 22 22 22 23 23 23 25 27 27 27 27 27 30 30 though it is a better way but writing the information in this way takes lot of time and concentration there is a possibility of missing some numbers if the information is collected for a larger number of persons the organizer therefore puts the information in a table form he draws three columns writes age in years tally vertical bar and number of players now he reads the ages one by one and draws one tally in the tally column against the age read if a number occurs five times he crosses the four tallies already drawn by a slash like this thus four tallies crossed by a slash stands for five members then he counts the tallies and write the numbers in the last column headed by number of players the pictograph of the above information is then drawn as shown on the screen here one face represents one player